After a long wait and pressure from different quarters, Education Cabinet Secretary Professor Jacob Kaimeni has finally issued new guidelines on the maximum fees payable to all public secondary schools. The maximum costs of this school is going to be 22,244. Uh, 22, While that of boarding schools will stand at 66,000. 424. I hope that is very clear. And for special needs secondary schools, it will be 69,810. According to the guidelines, public day schools will charge a maximum fees of 9,374 shillings. Boarding schools will charge fees capped at 53,553 shillings, while special needs schools will charge a maximum of 37,210 shillings annually. The new structure comes four months since the Kilemi Moiria led task force presented a report to the president. Kemeni's new fees guidelines are, however, 31% higher than those proposed by the task force, something that the CS was quick to justify. This increase takes cognizance of the fact that t teacher redistribution, as mentioned earlier on, and employment, rationalization of non-teaching staff, as was mentioned earlier on, merger of uneconomical schools, and implementation of proposed sub subsidies are yet to be effected. You know, this is something which will be done later. Eh? The new fees will apply to all public secondary schools, including national schools, and they take effect immediately. Under the new structure, schools will not be allowed to charge levies for infrastructure development and school transport projects with effect from next year. The Education Cabinet Secretary also directed school heads who have already overcharged parents and guidance to either refund the extra fees or spread them out to cover fees for the coming years. Patrick Igunza, Citizen TV.